Are you looking for action figures? Then head over to The Chosen Prime. The link is in the description. Just follow that. And man, they got everything your heart desires. Transformers, 5-2 toys, Power Rangers, Turtles, Marvel, DC, statues, whatever you want. Just go over and follow that link, man. You can order everything you want. Just order. Just go over there and order. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Thanks for coming back as always. I appreciate it. I really hope you're having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do the toy hunt. Yeah, love some of these toy hunts, man. All right, so going to, uh, this place is called the Batcave. It's in Conway, Arkansas, where I live where I live at. And it's a, you know, a comic book store slash action figures. It also has like one half. The front part is going to be, you know, the action figures, all that wonderful stuff. Or, you know, Warhammer, Magic the Gathering. Now, in the back, they have tons of tables, you know, for people to play role-playing games like you know, Pokemon, uh, we got, uh, you know, uh, Dungeons and Dragons, Magic the Gathering, whatever, all that stuff that, you know, I don't really, you know, play any of that stuff, but it's really cool that, you you know, we have a place that, you know, if you do, you can go there and play with a bunch of friends. Uh, there were people there playing, it was awesome, you know, watching a little bit of it. I didn't film any of that stuff, I didn't want to film anybody really, uh, just filmed the store. So I hope they, like, so like I said, they have a, you know, nice assortment of stuff, you know, they got Marvel, DC, they got some G.I. Joe, Turtles, Transformers, I mean, Doctor Who, uh, they got Walking Dead, they got a bunch of stuff, a Warhammer. Uh, so yeah, very nice uh, selection of stuff. I didn't get anything, really, don't, nothing really uh, caught my eye, but I really hope you like this thing. So definitely hit that like, share, prayers, and care bears, and hit that sub button from if you don't mind, if you don't mind. So let's just get right to it. Let's, uh, let's look at some toys at the Batcave in Conway, Arkansas. Yeah. So here is Batcave in Conway, Arkansas. So there we go. We got a nice little stormtrooper going on. Bunch of games. I have no clue what kind of games these are, but they look all right. Yeah, a bunch of stuff. I don't. I'm, I think these might be on sale or something, clearance or something. But yeah, they got like might have some clearance stickers on there. And you got some more games. You got some other stuff. Just some random. They got a lot of random stuff everywhere. I thought I said Pooey Tang at first. <laughs> <laughs> there you go some other more random stuff just i don't know just some weird stuff magic you know gathering like i said they do have a huge selection of uh role-playing games and stuff like that and warhammer but once again some more they have board games and stuff and role-playing stuff there you go i thought it was silly putty at first but it's not some other random stuff there you go some more Lots of random stuff. Terra, whatever that is. We got magic up there. Once again, some books. Who doesn't love to read? Some games and stuff. Mary Poppins. Who doesn't love some Mary Poppins? I love some Mary Poppins. More random stuff. And then we go into another, just the same wall. Just uh, some, well, no, lots of tons of games and stuff. Then we go on to some turtles. We got some turtle stuff action going on. There you go. Some uh, vehicles and we got some other turtle stuff. You got Leonardo. You got one Raphael down down there. You got this one lonely figure sitting down there. And I think you got Spider Man right over there too as well. That's pretty cool. So just a couple of turtle things going on right there. We got some nice monster stuff. I like that. It looks pretty cool. And then move on. We got some Simpsons. I like some Simpsons right there. A couple of Ghostbuster little things. Uh, some other stuff. Just random stuff, like I said. Got a Spawn figure down there. Star Wars. Like I said, just uh, some random stuff. We got the Fawns down there. Hey, how you doing? There you go. Some random other stuff like that. It's pretty cool. Then you got the same wall again. I don't said just gonna show everything that's on there. Just a bunch of random games, you know, and role playing role playing stuff and Duck Dynasty. And you got the zombie survival board game. That's pretty cool. Duck Dynasty, come on now. Got Marvel down there. Got some other stuff down there. Tons and tons of board games. Pretty cool. There's a big open shot of all that stuff. But yeah, they invest 
highly uh, a lot on uh, board game stuff there. It's a big store. It's a huge store. Like I said, the front half is you know mostly mostly you know action figures and games and stuff. And on the back, they have like tons of tables where you can play, you know, whatever you want to play. It's awesome. So yeah, a lot of the stuff I really don't know what it is. You know, like I said, I just I don't play this type of stuff. So, but it looks pretty cool. Like I said they got a bunch of random just. Lots of random stuff. So there you go. There's some long boxes over there. Pretty cool for comics. Then over, we got uh, Warhammer. Got the 40k stuff. If you like the little figurines, you can paint them. All that wonderful, great stuff. I've seen some really cool Warhammer stuff. Yeah, they got a whole lot of se a selection of this stuff. Pretty cool. And they got Magic the Gathering. Gathering. I'll show you some of that stuff later on. Yeah, some of the stuff, like I, I don't know what it is, but it's like kind of kind of like Warhammer. I don't know if it's all Warhammer. You know, it might be different stuff as well. But as far as I know, some of it is Warhammer. So that's pretty cool. Then moving on, we got, I have no clue what this stuff is. I mean, it was pretty cool looking, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know what this is. But they have some really cool uh, little action figures, figurines. It's pretty cool. So yeah, I got in there. And I have some stuff in some bins. I don't know what that is. You got some kind of like activity scenes or something, I guess. No clue. But it looks pretty neat o petito. I guess reasonable price. I mean, I, I didn't buy anything. Um, I bought a couple of things from them before, but I usually don't buy a lot of stuff from them. But that's pretty cool. A little blue thing. The little spikes and stuff, and then, like I said, moving on, this is a bunch of dice, you know, they got you know, for their games and stuff, and a whole lot of uh, Magic the Gathering. They got a bunch of cards, single cards, you know, got packs and all that stuff, booster packs. Uh, I don't know, if, uh, like I said, there were people playing stuff today, I don't know what they were playing. I kind of watched a little bit of them uh, while they were playing, but I, I don't know what they were playing at all. It wasn't Magic, I, I didn't see any of that stuff, but. That's some type of card game. But yeah, looks pretty cool. Bunch of magic cards. Is anybody into Magic the Gathering? Are these cards worth anything? I know a lot of them are, are not a lot, but there are some rare ones that uh, a lot of people like to collect. So there you go. There's a bunch of Magic the Gathering stuff. And then moving on to this. Like, I have no, definitely once again, I don't know what this stuff is. I've never seen it. The only time I've seen it is this place right here. Like I said, it could be part of a game or something that you play. I have no clue. But, you know, if you like this type of thing, you win. That's awesome. There you go. There's a big shot of that stuff right there. And guess what, folks? More stuff I have no clue what this is. I kind of don't. I think this is stuff maybe you could paint if you want to. Because it looked like they're, you know, prototypes. Or not prototypes, but, you know, just gray uh, stuff and it looks like you might could paint this kind of you know stuff i don't know like i said i have no clue what this is at all i don't think this is warhammer at all but it looks pretty neat you know you got some nice uh you know weird alien stuff some monster stuff like i said like i said it looks like you met you might can paint this stuff so if you love to paint and you love stuff like this this would be right up your alley like i said i have no clue what it is but it looks pretty cool Pretty cool. Yeah, if you like to paint, there you go. And then we got very nice, cool uh, Green Goblin uh, statue up there. Looks pretty cool. I don't know what that is, whatever that is. And then some of this stuff. I guess I don't. I think this is Warhammer. Yeah, there's some Warhammer stuff right here. A lot of uh, you know kits and stuff and things, figurines you can paint. Might be some books down there too as well. But that's Warhammer. Now this stuff, I don't know what it is. And then you got Battle Cat up there. Like I said, they got just stuff, you know, hanging around. Kill Team, I, I don't know what this is. Uh, it might be Warhammer stuff. I think it's it might be Warhammer since they're all together. So that might be some of it. So if you know, hit me up in the comments. Tell me if you like this kind of thing. Like I said, I've never done Warhammer. So I don't know, but I know what it is. And then you got uh, Walking Dead. Got some Walking Dead stuff. I've never bought anything from Walking Dead, but there you go. You got some figurines and stuff that looks pretty cool and then mini mates of a uh, walking dead and i think a book or something and more um 
I think this, I don't know if this is Warhammer. This is something different too. Something like Warhammer. Uh, like I said, hit me in the comments if you know what any of this stuff is. It might be with Warhammer since that is uh, Warhammer 2. So, like I said, it'd be pretty cool. I mean, if I, you know, if I had the time, I would probably try to paint some of these things. There you go. And then moving on, we got G.I. Joe 3 and 3 quarters. Man, they got a lot of options. If you love G.I. Joe, you got some cool stuff. You got, you know, Cobra. Uh, you got some of uh, Destro somewhere on over there. Uh, there's Snake Eyes right there. Uh, looks like a Viper thing you got right there. Uh, let's see. You got a uh, Cobra. Or there's a Trooper. Some other one. Some of them I couldn't see the names. I didn't really take the time out. There you go. There's a Crimson Guard. I think that was. And there's Destro right there. That looks pretty cool. And not too bad. You know, 11 bucks or something like that. I think they, I don't know if they're all uh, complete, but some of them got the back cards and stuff. Here's a Trooper. You know, so they got a pretty good selection of uh, three and three quarter stuff for G.I. Joe. So that's pretty cool. And then I think this, some of that stuff might be from the movie. I don't know. One of them, like that one I just, the second one, might be from the movie. Uh, you got some other ones right there. Uh, some sitting down, just chilling. Got some troopers. There you go. So I don't know all the names of these, but I know some of them. Got Roblox. Got a couple of Roblox around there. A lot of Vipers and a lot of troopers too. So pretty cool. Nice little, you know, little sec selection of uh, GI Joes. There's Snake Eyes. I think that was. There's a Flipper guy. <laughs> Scuba, Scuba Bill, or Scuba Bob. And there's some more. Like I said, they got a nice little selection of these uh, GI Joes. And like I said, you know, decently priced too. Some 11, some about $20. Not too bad. There you go. There's a Viper, I think. And there's some more. More GI Joes. Real American Hero. Yeah, there you go. That's a nice little selection of G.I. Joes. Anybody see anyone they wanted or they like? And then move on. This is some wrestlers. I don't know who that was. I think it's Booker T up there. They got John Cena, uh, Kane, yeah, a bunch of old, old wrestlers. These are, I think there's an older. I don't know what you know uh, they were called. These are you know called or anything, but some of the wrestling stuff. A DDP. That's another. So pretty cool. There's a bunch of nice wrestlers. I like how they're displayed like that. That's pretty cool. And then we got Dragon Ball Z. I don't know a lot about Dragon Ball Z, but I think this is Dragon Ball Z. Yeah, there you go. So if you got you're a big Dragon Ball Z fan, what are these? What line are these from? I don't I don't know for sure. Just like the wrestling, I don't know what lines they were from. But that is Dragon Ball Z stuff. In the back of that uh, Green Goblin statue, and then you got some. This is this is like DC stuff. Yeah, there's Batman, Aquaman, uh, some other ones. Flash. I don't know what line these are from, but there's a nice selection of DC stuff and everything. I don't know who some of these are. <laughs> I don't keep up a lot with DC. I know the main ones. You know, Wonder Woman, Superman. There's some cool Superman. There's a, the uh, Mad, I forgot his name. What was the Mad guy's name? I forgot his name off the top. Alfred? Was it Alfred or something? I think it's Alfred. He got some Star Trek uh, ornaments. So if you're a big Star Trek fan, there you go. There's some pretty cool ornaments. I do collect Transformer ornaments. Those are awesome. And then moving over, and this is Marvel. And then there's some turtle stuff. There you go. You got some nice turtle Stuff right there, three boxes of those. Little gift sets like that, or box sets. And there you go, there's some uh, Marvel stuff. Like I said, I think these are Marvel Legends from the older stuff. There's a Punisher, Rhino, the Iron Man, uh, Wasp over there. You got Bullseye, Wolverine, uh, Sentry. And then Black Cat, there's Venom. So, nice little selection of uh, 
older. I guess they're Marvel Legends. I think they are. Got some other ones. Yeah, those are some Marvel Legends. Fantastic Four. Storm. They got a storm over there. Got a short and stubby Iron Man right there. Got the Hulk down there. That's awesome. Green Goblin. Spider Man. Uh, Ant Man, I think, is over there. And Ghost Rider. I think that last one's Ghost Rider. But that was the Marvel and DC, some of the open stuff. And then they had this cage full of, uh, you know, Marvel stuff. And looks like Spider Man. I see Captain America there. Iron Man. Star Wars. I don't know. This is just loose stuff that, you know, probably not worth anything. But, you know, they had a cage for it. Then we got Power Rangers. I don't know what line these are, uh, but this is the Power Rangers. Is it the older or newer stuff? There's some beefy. Look at that beefy yellow one. My gosh, he didn't miss chest day. But this is some Power Rangers stuff. I, like I said, I don't know what line they're from. Well, you know, you like Power Rangers? There you go. I'm not a, I've never really collected any Power Rangers. It was a little after they were, came out right when I got done collecting. So there's some other ones. The Power Chargers or Power Rangers or... There you go, some other stuff. Oh, yeah, Power Rangers. Yay. Who doesn't love some Power Rangers? And then we got, now this is box DC stuff. Everything, there's a Superman coming up that I really almost got. He looks pretty cool. I'll just show you there, right there, uh, right below. That Superman right there. Does anybody got that one? If they do, hit me up in the comments and tell me what they think of it. I may go back and get that guy. I like Superman. He's one of my favorite DC characters, so I don't have a good Superman action figure. There's some other ones. You got the Joker. That's pretty cool. Super villains. Uh, you got some other ones there. Yeah. I've never seen these before. Super villains. I think Marvel Legends did one for their villains. They did a line for villains. But, um,. There's another Superman, the Icons. Anybody got that one? I may pick that one up too. Very cool. And then some more boxed uh, DC stuff. There you go. I think Harley Quinn was back there, I think. You got Robin. And you got some other ones. Like I said, I don't know all the DC stuff. And then you got the DC multi universe. And I think I see these in Target all the time at Walmart. But they look pretty cool. Does anybody collect these? What do y'all think of these guys? The Green Lantern. And there's another Superman. Looks pretty cool. Like I said, if anybody got any of these Supermans, hit me up in the comments. Tell me what you think of those. And we got some more DC stuff. I don't know all these guys. We got one of the older penguins. I think that was from the 90s, I think. I say that was a 90s line. But there you go. That's a section of uh, DC. Then we got some pops. Uh, we got <laughs> Ron Burgundy. That's pretty cool. That was random. Uh, some pops and stuff. You know, I don't. I, I collect a couple. You know, I had some Transformer ones and I have prints. But uh, these were pretty cool. I think there was a um, uh, Harry uh, or Dumb and Dumber. I think Dumb and Dumber is coming up soon. I think. Yeah, there you go. You got Harry and Lloyd. That's pretty cool. I have some uh, more pops and more pops, big pops, small pops. And you got some drawings up there of GI Joe, which I thought were pretty cool. They are nicely framed. Don't know what they are, but looks cool. Like some blue uh, sketches or something. And there you go. Some more pops. So they didn't have a whole lot of pops. You know, usually the places like this have tons and tons of pops but just a nice little section and then there's there's superman and then some power rangers i remember those were walmart's they were just clogging up the shelves darth vader that tons of so that's the back of there and you got the cobra wants you that's a pretty cool book and you got some NECA back to the future you got some black series and then you got a bunch of star wars stuff olders uh, i want to say you know late you know i want to say what 2000 late 90s 2000 stuff I don't know a whole lot about this stuff, but yeah, tons of these little older stuff, the three and three quarters. And yeah, it looks like Star Wars. Yeah, nice little gathering of uh, Star Wars figures. There's Chewie, Chewbacca. 
yeah. Uh, I don't think I collect any of these. I don't think so. I'm not a big Star Wars collector, so don't know a whole, whole lot about this stuff, but there's a nice little section of uh, some older figures. That's pretty cool. The cards are not in that great shape, but you know. But there you go, Star Wars. And then we got some uh, DC, or what is this? Yeah, this is DC. Got some of the Batman, Bane. I think that was Bane one right there, yeah. So we got some of this DC stuff. I don't know what this is, but it looks pretty cool. Then you got some Marvel, random Marvel stuff. Thor, Iron Man, Captain America. Iron Man again. Yeah, a couple. I mean, these are, I think, is that three and three quarters as well? I think they are. But uh, I remember I had, used to collect a couple of those once in a while. Just have all the Hulks. There's a uh, Doc Ock. So there you go. So there's some random stuff and the Hulk right there on the bottom by himself. And then the, the uh, alien and stuff, you know, that's been the Walmart on uh, my last video. You know, I asked if anybody got these and got a nice response. They said they're pretty cool. So I may have to check them out. I'll probably get them at Walmart. They're a little more expensive here, but. And we got Marvel Legends. Now this is older stuff. There you go. You got a uh, Nemo right there. I think that's a, not Nemo, but a, uh, what was his name? I forgot his name. He was in Captain America just recently, or a uh, well, Falcon and Winter Soldier. Anyways, that was a variant. He had, he had his mask off. Uh, I had a couple of these too as well. I had some other Hulk figures. I had some Spider-Mans too. They're superheroes. And you got Marvel Select. Um, I guess they got these whenever Hastings went out of business. If anybody know what a Hastings is, Hastings used to get a lot of imported stuff, and they had tons of Marvel Selects. That's where I got a lot of mine. But yeah, they went out of business, so I'm guessing they got theirs. There's a bunch of other uh, Marvel Legends, some of the newer stuff, and a little older stuff. And there you go. There's some stuff in the back. There you go. Ant-Man back there. Yeah. Bunch of nice uh, selection of Marvel Legends. If you're a big Marvel Leg Marvel Legends collector, this would be right up your alley. Wasp. I used to I used to have tons of Marvel Legends. I just didn't have any room. Everything. There you go. Red Skull. Wasn't that Red Skull hard to get at one time? Uh, one of them. One of them at that line was hard to get. Oh damn! Another Marvel Select. You got Captain America. Another Captain America. Yeah, see, I think I thought that was maybe a harder one to get. I used to, I don't know. I may, I don't know if it is now, but it used to be. There's a other one. I think AIM is that, that, that what they're called? AIM stuff. There's the ones behind them. There's a bunny. <laughs> Those wasp. Uh, let's see some other ones. So there you go. That's uh, Marvel Legends in box. And then you got some uh, Doctor Who. <laughs> If you're a big Doctor Who fan, I'm, I'm not, but that's pretty cool. You got some action figures of Doctor Who. There you go. I don't know who that is. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Don't know who that is. And I definitely don't know who these are, but there you go. Doctor Who. And there you go. And Avengers. These are pretty cool. Never seen these before. I think these are a little older, I think, too, as well. And then got some Fantastic Four, looks like, or yeah, got Spider Man. Like I said, just some random stuff, just you know, hanging out. And there's some other stuff I don't know, I don't know what that is, but there you go. And then we got a, uh, we got some like a Hellboy. And we got some other random stuff, you know, Vulture, Thundercats. We got some Thundercat stuff, stuff that I don't know what that is down there. Put a couple of Thundercats. And then here we go. We got some uh, graphic novels. And they got a bunch of statues here. You got Punisher. Daredevil. Looks pretty good. And you got some other of these. Little Thor. Uh, three and three quarters. I think that's what they were. And then you got, like I said, some graphic no novels. And you got Venom up there. That Venom looks pretty cool. I think I try to get a close-up of that thing. Looks pretty good. The Hulk up there, very nice. You got the Batman, you got Joker and Harley Quinn, Taskmaster, very nice. Got another Hulk up there. That's Red Hulk up there. 
Spider-Man, Batman. I said, just a bunch of random stuff, you know, Marvel and DC. Bunch of Aquaman, bunch of uh, statues and stuff that look pretty cool. You got a video game right there. You got Joust and Defender. I love Joust. It's pretty cool. Yeah, other stuff right there. Tons of graphic novels. They do have comics as well. A nice selection of comics. I don't uh, really film anything from the comics, but there's a nice little selection of uh, graphic novels and other stuff like that. A pretty good Vampirella right there. There you go. And then here's a couple Transformers. All right, some box Transformers. There's Blackout. You got Hot Rod right there. You got the Starscream. It's a good one. You got that Ultra Magnus from the uh, animated. I think it was animated, was it? And then Cheetor. You got the Ark. Is that the Ark? I think they would call it. Yeah. Grimlock. And then two of the uh, AOE stuff. And I said there's some more comics right there. So they got a pretty good selection of comics. And then the other side, you got Squeaks over there. There you go. Huffer, that's a good one. Brainstorm. You got RC and Willjack. Uh, what else you got over there? Eight Face, Eight Face, Megatron, Black Arachnia, Hardhead, and some other stuff. And there is uh, Michelangelo. And then we got some of these little Halo, Halo things. I don't know what these are. I don't know what Halo is, but. These are pretty cool. Tons. Got a nice lot of selection of that there. If you're, you know, an inbox collector or whatever, a hanger, you, know, you might not want to get those. And then you got some stuff from, you know, uh, they're loose. I like that. That's about $240. Is that a good price for that? The MicroMaster base? I don't know for sure. That looks good. And then you got a box Metroplex back there. You got Cheetor, some Beast Wars. That's cool. Primal and Megatron. You got. Rodimus and Ultra Magnus. You got other ones. You got Sea Spray, Optimus Prime from G2. Well, nice little selection of G1 and some earlier or some recent stuff. A bunch of movie stuff right there from Bayverse. You got very cool. You got some. I don't know if those are Transformers, but those are something. Then you got Ultra Magnus and a Alternator Sideswipe there, and then these four things. I don't know what they were. I think they were Transformers. There you go. Cool. There's a, uh, what is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, is that a Beetlejuice? Then you got the uh, Ghostbusters. That's pretty cool. The older Ghostbuster stuff. <laughs> you got some lunch boxes. You got Gizmo back there. Some He-Man. Got Panthor and the Ram Man over there. That's pretty cool. There's Piggy down there. And then you got some, I don't know what that was up there. Uh, Ghostbuster, more Ghostbuster stuff. And you got some, uh, Let's see, G.I. Joe vehicles. A couple G.I. Joe stuff. And more G.I. Joe. More G.I. Joe right there. And he got these glasses. I remember having these glasses. You got them from Pete's Hut or something. I remember a lot of those. I had the Muppets and stuff. And then more graphic novels and some uh, statues. And everything and action figures. You got Deadpool up there. Some nice uh, comics and stuff. There's Carnage. Looks pretty cool. Went and watched that movie last weekend. There's Shazam. Got some Batman. Some more Star Wars stuff. You got other stuff with there. Deadpool, Batman, Star Wars. Like I said, just a just a mixture of uh, goodness. Just a bunch of mixture of goodness. You got Wolverine. You got Silver Surfer stuff back there. More Wolverine. Very nice. We got some Star Wars. Some books. Love reading. Mr. Sinister. That's pretty cool. Morbius. Spawn. There you go. Avengers. There's, uh, Captain Marvel. Some more books. Yeah, some other stuff. And then Venom. That's a pretty cool little statue. Then you got the back wall. Once again, you got some more statues. You got Wonder Woman, Superman, a uh, mixture of just, you know, DC and Marvel. Uh, you got some alien stuff up there too as well. You got that Planet Hulk. That looks pretty good. That's awesome. I wish I, if I still collected Hulk. I'd definitely get that. You got Thanos up there. Another Hulk up there. Looks pretty good. I love the reflector, the color that comes off of that. And then you got some random stuff, you know, Spider-Man, you know, DC stuff also as well. 
Let's see, you got Spider Gwen. That was pretty cool. Got Black Panther up there. Got Scarlet Witch. Another Joker and Harley Quinn going up there. And you got some comics. Some other small stuff. You got Thanos. You got the Infinity Gauntlet. You got Superman up there. I'm thinking that was Dark Seed. Is it Dark Steed? I think is what it's called. I don't know for sure, but that looks like a cool one. There's another cool one. Looks like a statue of Superman. It's like a Batman too, and Carnage, Joker, and some other little stuff and everything. So there you go. This is about the end of it. So there, right there, you got some more comics. So there you go. Well, all right, folks, I hope you liked that tour of uh, the little local, you know, comic shop I have. Uh, only have in here in Conway, Arkansas. Uh, there is one in Little Rock. Uh, there used to be a couple, but they've shut down. You know, you know they closed down. Uh, but yeah, this one is local. It's like I said, it's called the Bat Cave. It is located in uh, Conway, Arkansas. It's pretty cool. You know, it's got a nice selection. Like I said, it's got a variety of stuff from action figures to, you know, magic, you know, all that stuff and, you know, comics. And you also got uh, statues. And so you got a whole lot of section, you know, selection of uh, Star Wars, Warhammer, Transformers, uh, Doctor Who. Uh, you got Marvel, DC, just a bunch of, you know, just cool stuff and everything. And it's a nice place to hang out. Like I said, if you like to play, you know, those you know type of games and card games, this is a perfect place for you. Like I said, I got to, you know, sit there and watch some uh, people playing some stuff. Like I said, I didn't know what they were playing. I had no clue what it was. I didn't really ask a lot of questions. I just sit there and watched them a little bit. But, yeah, it's fun. So, yeah, it's a really great channel. Uh, they used to be in another location, but now they move into this place. Uh, now they've been there for maybe a couple of years, and it's a it's a big place. So yeah, it's really cool. Oh, there's another place outside of uh, Little Rock that uh, has a uh, kind of action figure thing. I may go to there uh, sometime if I get a chance. So uh, film there, you know. So if y'all like that, so really hope y'all like this kind of thing. If you do, definitely hit those likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. It really helps out the channel. Almost to 6,000. I can't wait. I really appreciate that. And hit me up with some comments. Tell me what you thought of the, you know, this kind of thing. Do you like it? If you do, I'll definitely do some more of it. If I mispronounced or just didn't know what I was talking about on some of the stuff, I apologize. You know, just, you know, just give me a little break. I'm trying. This is my, you know, second time to do a toy hunt in a long time. So uh, I do got another toy hunt coming. I went to Little Rock and I went to a couple of Walmarts and Targets. So I'll have that up couple of days from now, probably maybe tomorrow, who knows, but I hope you liked it. And as always be good to yourself. Hell Hasbro and hell just, you know, collecting toys and good night folks.